Well, count me in, probably. I mean, it looks really good. The first Dragon's Gama is like a better Skyrim. Really? Adam, get in here and chat with me. I'm playing my friend's game here. Whoops. I need settings. Just a second. I'm going to fix it, guys. I got to fix it up. Please fix it up. Okay. Has no idea about a game she spent two hours making a cover for. Of course I didn't. Do you think that I think that I do my homework? Do you know that I'm a mother and I have 18 jobs that I'm doing and I have 50 deadlines that I'm behind on and I'm kind of like, well, let's see how I, let's see how I do not being as prepared as usually I usually am. New season of the guild. Um, you know, HC, I was supposed to be uploading the guild to TikTok. But I didn't. I know Stardew Valley. I don't know if I should go back, but I kind of want to. No, there's no season, new season of the guild. Not yet. Not yet. There would never be another web series. No one funds web series. There's no, there is zero percent chance that anyone would give me money to make a web series. If anybody has an, a person that would belie that fact, what happened to the table thing you were talking about? Table thing? I don't know. What's up? F. Chase, I was working with Tom all week on a writing project, and we have to get back. Yes. It's on the list, man. I am, like, now slicing and dicing my days by the hour, and it's stressing me out. What's up, Adam? Why? Oh, it's a good game, right? I know. We can't hear Adam? Okay, wait just a second, y'all. Let me get Adam in here. I think it's just because he's muted, because I mute the, the Discord, because when I logged off from Bonnie, I have to manually mute Discord so everyone doesn't hear my business. Wait, why is this so big? My business. My business. Um, how are you, Adam? I'm okay. I'm tired. How Why? Are Why are you tired? Because I've been walking on this treadmill for almost an hour. And an hour? The a tiny amount of exercise is very tiring, tiring to me. Oh, that's really good. You're back on your, uh, I, didn't we just discuss that you haven't been doing any yeah, exercise? I'm back on it. Crash! We'll, we'll see, we'll see. Luna, ow! Oh, she's really cute. Oh, is can I date him? Deckhand. Uh, when I saw this, I immediately knew this was a game for you again. I mean, I will be transparent. I know the person who made it. So oh, very cool. Yeah, but she is pretty cool. And this is a little indie game that she's been working on. It's a big labor of love. And I was like, I'm going to check this out. But also, it has the word potion in the title. Yeah. So that like requires me to play it anyway, right? Yeah. Are you if all? I'm correct, I saw uh, the developer also got smushed by EA. Why? What? Invisibility. Uh, I, I think when this first came out, the day it came out, EA also released like 10 games on Steam and pushed this right off the like new and. Oh, you know, no. That sucks. That yeah, sucks. I mean, I mean it's. This... There's got to be a better system than that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, why would they release 10? That's ridiculous. Are you all right down here? Do you need me to take off my small vest? I think so. My head broke my fall. I think we run around. Thank these potions of healing and stay below decks. Topside is no place for a young lass. Screw you, misogynist. Rawr! What else is going on, Adam? Have you beaten all the levels of the Deep Rock Galactic? No, I keep getting stuck on the vine one. Because I, I just, I'm obsessed with using the miner guy. That's a very like, loud that's round. the best one. Yeah. Easily the best. Oh, the miner, yeah. The last one, that's the one that I keep playing. Yeah, you gotta. If you play anything else in it, yeah. you're stupid. Yeah, the miner is the best. Now I want to play this game. No, no, no. Play this game. I want to play this game, game too, but there's just no time. I don't know when I'm going to stream. I'm working on Friday and Saturday. I have a convention. It's a supernatural convention in Burbank, which is great because I can go home at night. Um, and hey, is it your fault that I constantly get recommended like 
supernatural related stuff? It's locked. Um, yes, I'm I'm definitely inside your computer. No. Because I've never seen the show. And it's just always like, what are the guys' names? That's always the main guys in that show. It's Jared always like, and Jensen. Hey Adam, you might be interested in Jensen something or other. He's pretty great. Jensen Ackles. I mean, he's very attractive. He's someone to aspire to be. That's all I'm telling you, Adam, okay? Listen, is that the guy that was in The Boys? Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. Get back, devil fish. I shall have your tentacles hung from the main yard like the slimy... What on earth is that thing? It's the Kraken. You should have stayed below deck, girl. These people... I'm sorry. Do you call everybody boy and man, too? Uh-oh, wait, what's going on here? I better not stumble into these weapons. They look sharp. Whoa! Wonderful, dear girl. Taunting that beast to attack our weaponry was a stroke of genius. Well done. Okay, I, that was a screw-up. Okay, that was a screw-up. Um, I'm gonna maybe take... I better not stumble into these weapons. They look sharp. Uh, I guess I shouldn't have done that. And I... Watch out for the oil! Don't let it catch oh. fire! Oh, this is awful. Um, I'm a disaster. Yeah, it seems like you're not doing great so far. No, I'm not. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, and I have no help left. Uh, or, um, let me maybe drink this. Okay, it's okay, you guys. I'm fine. David, it's okay. Um, wow. I don't know. Maybe I'll lead it over here. It can kill you, Sinbad. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, Adam, what have you been, what have you been doing lately? What, besides, you know, what have you been doing? Uh, I've been doing a lot of times uh, protecting democracy. What? Yeah. Why? Uh, just. Uh, I mean, I keep, have you not heard about the automaton threat? The automaton threat? Yeah, they've been invading. The automatons? What? Do you not follow the news? No. Yeah, the automatons. Well, there's all sorts of like propaganda out there that maybe the automatons actually we oppress them. But I think the truth of the matter is, and coming right from the Ministry of Truth themselves, it's that the automatons are the bad guys. So we need to wipe them out. Otherwise, you know, they're going to destroy our way of life. Okay. And how are you, how are you accomplishing that? Oh, I just set it on fire! Sinbad, suck well, it! I'm doing my part. <laughs> so what, I mean, what does that mean? Uh, Gary and I enlisted to be hell divers, and we have been... Oh, God, okay. <sighs> We've been hell diving. All right. And uh, fighting back the threat. And actually, we freed a planet that manufactured the, these mechs. So now we can actually use mechs in our fight against them. Okay. Which is pretty sick, because mechs are dope. Yeah, okay, great. That took me way too oh. long, Felicia. You know, Admiral, I have other things on my mind that are professional and actually, like, <laughs> career-oriented going on. I have, I'm tired. I don't know why one hour of, ch have you been laggy? Have you been laggy, Adam? Because my God, I just can't deal with this one hour time shift. Why are we waking uh, yeah. up in the middle of the night? Why? Why Why was that a decision? It's bullshit. It's for farmers or something. And it like, why? it's totally unnecessary. It's absolute bullshit and they should abolish it. Why do farmers need to wake up in darkness and go to sleep at light? Like it doesn't, it's just, no, no, no. that's what I'm, I don't understand I don't think that's it. what the plan was. I think it was, I think it's the other way, wasn't it? <laughs> I don't know, but I know. It's to give shoppers an extra hour of daylight. Well, it, you're making all the children and most people who work uh, a day, a nine to five, wake up in darkness every morning. Okay? Yeah, but it's not like people change their hours. It's... Uh... Things are still gonna close at the same time. Wait, I'm so sorry. An hour ahead, hour behind. You mean all your other boats have sunk? Well, yes, miss. Why do you think we charge so little for the fare? This guy is awful at what he does. Sinbad. It's far from the largest point, but it's one of my favorites. There's always adventure to be found near Old Haven. Hey, cabin boy. Thank you, miss. We would have been lost to sea without your bravery. Would you like this tiny little nipple vest? 
I, I wish we would go to some sort of like space time system. Just get rid of all time zones. Okay. That's that. Well, let's, we're on daylight savings time now. It's the other way that it's the proper way. Yes, that's what I thought. So we should be waking up with the light and going to sleep when it's dark. That's what I thought. Yeah. You know, how about we just get rid of time? Uh oh, this girl, this girl has bitch face. Excuse me, what happened uh -oh. to this ship? I was attacked by a huge sea monster just before I arrived. I kind of saved it. I mean, Emily seems pretty cool. I know, you have toxic. By the way, Adam, you are posting videos of your dog on TikTok, and I don't think you have a dog anymore. Is that old no, I, footage that you're just trying to I recycle? A video. I posted a video because someone told me I should post the video where I, I taught my dog how to ring a bell to go out to pee. But just to be clear, so you don't that dog is not in residence anymore. No, that dog is living in Toronto now. So will the uh, do you miss having a dog? I mean, I still get pictures of my dog. Yeah, but that's not the same, buddy. No, it's not the same, obviously. But it is, I mean, <clears throat> okay. Thank you, Speaker. Felicia. Yeah? When you go to Poland. Wait. Are you going to post a <laughs> When you go to Poland, are you going to like post a picture or say something about, well, my grandma, I loved my grandma. Here I am in Poland. Uh, like, because you shouldn't be able to because she's gone now, Felicia. <laughs> That's it. I don't know no with more. this analogy, tying it to yeah, my well, recently dead grandma. I'm just kind of stretching here. I mean, your mom has been dead for a long time. I could, I feel like I could do whatever I want with that it's material. It's a competition who was dead first. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> Alrighty. Hey, thank you so much for the sub speaker and for watch, finishing Third Eye. Listen. Luna arrived. I'm here to study with my grandmother who doesn't happen to be dead. Study. Yeah, my grandmother is the town's potion master and I'm here to learn to trade. You learn the intricacy of one of the most complicated forms of magic. Wow, she is your type, Adam. Yeah, she seems great. I mean, she's not gonna stab a fork in your leg, but maybe, maybe on the sixth day. I doubt you'd even grasp the basic time. concepts. You're just gonna get in her way when Odehaven needs her services dearly. What are you doing, Cheeky? Go back to home to be coddled and let more morthy person be her apprentice. <gasps> oh, man. Very aggressive. Hey, you know what I saw on Twitch today that's pretty cool? Uh-huh. Hey, Daniel, thank you so much, David. David McDaniels. I saw a woman, uh, so she was, she had two cameras. She has one on her butt. Uh, on Twitch? And Yeah, and one on her face. So you can see her butt and her face. Is she standing or sitting? Is it like a sitting butt? She's standing. She's standing. Okay. Ooh. But even better, it gets better. Like that's that's become a general thing you can kind of see on Twitch sometimes. That's cool. Like go ahead, do whatever you want. But whatever. This woman in particular, who's very smart, she green screened out her short. So every time she wants to show a video, her butt turns into the screen. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. Cat yeah, mushroom. It's excellent. No one knows how related these fungi are to mushrooms. A firm fungus with a distinctive brown cap. Okay. Blueberries quickly and thoroughly stains clumsy fingers. Hardy berries favored by witches from colder climates. Love it. Love it. Love it. Okay, I just got a bunch of loot from this encounter. All right. Um, so you're just sitting there. To be clear, for the last hour, you have just been walking on a treadmill looking at a woman's butt. I mean, no judgment, but... No. I was looking at a woman's butt earlier. Uh -huh. and I was looking through her butt. Through her butt, okay. Um, this must be the place. But she's also very funny and cool. But, yes, I have been walking on the treadmill, but I've been playing that stupid freaking game. Uh, huh, it's locked. I mean, I want to play that game 12 hours a day. Hi, you're looking for the potions master, right? Her house is just over there. My name is Stranger, and I'm 17 feet tall. Look at this. He's at least three feet. Look, he's twice my height. Wait, hang on. Hang Look on, how hang big on. this guy is. Are you a child? I don't know. I'm hitting on everybody, so I should know that before I do my role play. Yeah, wait, was that other girl a child? I mean, she was a bitchy child, and I don't even like to use that word, but like, she is has some attitude problems, okay? <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna, like, let's find out how old these characters are first. Yeah, before I, yeah, <laughs> we really need to maybe... 
We've Wait. made this mistake. <laughs> I know. I know. Look at this girl. Hi. Learn my song said you were coming. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm gonna be wonderful to have another girl my age here. Uh oh, she's a girl her age. Uh oh. Please accept this ivy as a symbol of our new friendship. Are we married? A bundle of ivory that can cause irritation. Thanks, Mary. I'm so excited for the girl my age. Are we gonna be friends? All right. Well, this girl is unpleasant to say the least. And there's another little girl. This is the Isle of Lost Girls. I think at nighttime is dark, so you can imagine your fears with less distractions. I'm a precocious child. I'm holding Calvin and Hobbes. She's holding Calvin and Hobbes. I mean, no one else can see that because your face is in front of it. Okay, well, I just crushed this box and I got time. Okay, I love the fact that I'm just stealing stuff from just random boxes. Let me go in the inn. I'm not going, I'm not going in here. Okay, I am a child, because look at this guy. He's seven feet tall. Look at this. All the girls are four feet tall, and all the men are seven feet tall. Interesting. Poor Emily just hasn't been the same since her father fell ill. Thank you for the bits, Kelstris. Kelstris. Yo, what's this guy's hat? I don't know. He's wearing. It looks like he just made a hat out of a newspaper and put it on there. <laughs> Poor Emily. Can I get a... Okay, I guess I can't get a... Dude, you can put a little bit more effort into the decoration. I mean, it's a fishing net and just raw wall. I don't Did he know. say what he does? There's traumatic. There's some traumatic sexual dimorphism in this valley. It's true. <laughs> Two table it. The music is very good. This must be the place. Oh, that's not my voice. This must be the place. Hello. Oh, Luna, my dear. Welcome. How my, how have you grown? Nice to see you, Grandmother. Please call me Granny. Everyone else here around here just- romancing Granny. Okay. Now I understand you've shown some skill in the craft of potion brewing. I wouldn't exactly call it skill. I'm just trying to make some brown dye to color a scuff in the door and it exploded. I killed 15 people. Exploded, you say? Yes, I blew the back porch right off the house. Mother was so mad at me. Again, she died. Wonderful, dear. You must have the talent. Go on, tell me how you made this explosion. Well, there were some mushrooms around. They were almost the right color brown, so I ground them up. It was too light to match the door, though, so I added a bit of ash from the fireplace until the shape matched. And then? I didn't have a brush, so I found a feather to apply it, and bam, it blew up the second I touched it with a feather. Oh, a minor explosion potion. Marvelous, my dear. You do have the talent. Take care, people. Now go collect a mushroom, ash, and a feather. You should be able to find ash and feathers at McDonald's farm. There should be plenty of mushrooms at the edge of the deep dark forest. Off you go. Can I just choose you ash from the fireplace here and wreak havoc on my own supply? Quack! Certainly not. Go search out these ingredients and come back when you gather them all. And then clean my house. <laughs> um, can you draw at all? No, not at all. Yeah, me neither. I can you? People can make like, drawings up stuff like this. Yeah, I, I just. Also, the music again is very good here. Whoops! Talented people piss me off. I know. May I help you? Can you please help me collect these herbs? Tap the space bar to interact with the closest object and collect all the harvested. I just collected like 55 chives or something. Thank you so much. Please keep them and put them to good use. Okay, this girl's stalking me. First of all, she gave me a piece of ivy. Never met her before. And it supposedly strangles you. And then she just... Is her mother Miss Muffet? It must be Miss Muffet, yeah. She's the daughter of a spider. And then she's... Wait, then she would be Mrs. Muffet? Ms. No, How do you become a Mrs.? Ms. Is that a marriage thing or a kid thing? Mrs. is you're, you're married. Mrs. Oh. your husband's name, basically. Thank you, FaZe Cat. She wants to look at my full moon. Okay, so I need a feather and ash. What's this? Okay. Well, I need to find the McDonald's farm. Is the huntsman here? Can I murder a pig? What's going on here? Okay. Is it old McDonald's farm? I don't know, but all I like any situation where I can loot boxes and make things. Well, you guys, this is a this is very my my kind of game. I don't know how to Who get. Who would have figured? I don't know how to get in here though. Cute potion creation. Yeah. Clearly, some farming or something. Yep. 
Well, she said I gotta go An to the annoying character to do voices for. <laughs> yep, perfect, perfect. Checks all. Checks the boxes. boxes. Thanks for the request. Get My best friend's a demon. Okay, can we go? Get out of my house, Mary. Stop stalking me. Throw Rosalind in the lake. I should. Uh oh, now I can go down here. That seven foot guy is not boggling me anymore. Okay. Ooh. Deep dark forest, farm, and desert. Where should we go? Let's go to the deep dark forest. Feels like I can kill something there. Yeah, it seems like a good idea. Okay. I want an axe. I want to chop things. I want to chop people. Yeah, that's a really aggressive volcano that was going on there, by the yeah, way. Yeah, it was... <laughs> it seems I... like it's going to be a problem. Yes. Yeah, like... <laughs> maybe need to evacuate. Oh, look at this. Going into a cave. Hi. I'm going to gather some ingredients and try not to be murdered. Ooh, I am shrooming it out. It's like I'm in Humboldt County. That was a California... Uh-oh. I went in here. Ooh, there's a tarot card here. A basilisk card. Man, magic mushrooms grew all around here wild when I was a kid. Did you eat them or? Cause you should no, not just- I was always too afraid. Yeah, you should not be eating random mushrooms. That's what I'm worried about. Oh! <gasps> I mean, I don't eat any mushrooms cause they're gross. Um, you know what I had the other day? Mushroom- Something gross? Mushroom tacos. And I'm not a big mushroom fan, but these were made so good. I loved it. What does that mean? Like, it means mushroom is the main yeah. ingredient? Yeah, basically it was like stir-fried mushrooms, and they were, I don't know how they were seasoned. It was an amazing restaurant in San Jose. Oh, and it was it's like a meat replacement. Ma right? Meat replacement. It was so good, and they had handmade tortillas that were just that. great. Basilisk. Okay. Yeah, because people, like, fry up, like, a mushroom, like a, what are those, portobello? No. Yeah, portobello. Uh, I like portobello. Ones. And eat that, like, as a... As though it's a steak, basically. Yeah, it's really good. Portobello's are good. I just don't know how to cook anything, so that just feels... And also my family, um, who I cook for, we're, we're, a, we're a separated family. Like, I have a child and a partner who I sometimes cook for and myself, and I'm like, all of, all of, all of us have different tastes. And of course, yeah. I end up catering to the other people. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. It's pretty. No, sounds like you need a private chef. Well, let's win that lottery. I think that's the one rich person indulgence that I would have if I had all the money in the world. I would probably not live much differently. Um, mm -hmm. I probably would do less social Just media would... and 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 more hiring other people to cook for me. Uh, just in general, like a nutritional... Yes. Someone who's taking care of nutrition. Yeah, because the problem like, is... No. Yeah, because the problem is... Um, I mean, you eat out all the time and everything's so salty and you get bloaty and it's not like you feel great. So all the money in the world doesn't help. You know, if you eat out all the time, you're gonna look bad. You're gonna feel bad and look bad. Hey, question, why Why are there people that look like Chris Hemsworth? Yeah, oh God, how do I kill something? How do I kill something? Am I just powerless in this game? I don't know. It looks as if this could shatter easily. All right, so we need to do a potion of shattering or something. <laughs> a soot sprite? Who knew soot could have a sweet tooth? Oh my god, it's so cute! It's a little soot sprite and a mush doom. So Jeffrey Diane points out, lead it past the laser thing. See if it'll, like, get blasted. Oh, where's that laser thing? I mean, it's to the left. The thing that almost blasted you. Oh, yeah! Yes. Good job there, buddy! Mushroom spores. <gasps> Rare spores blown off a of live mushroom. That's amazing. Good job. Thank you. Now I need a key or something to get here. It's locked. Okay. All right. I think I got to come back here. This is definitely my kind of game. Okay. I'm just going to get all the mushrooms I can because I know that I'm going to be wanting to shroom it up later. Mountain cherries. Yo, Felicia. What? Have you watched Shogun yet? No, it's good. Dude, it is one of the best things I've watched. Really? In God knows how long. Oh yeah, my like God. it is spectacular. Every like the costumes, the sets. Oh my God, it's just mind blowing. I did re like, see an article of of how they faithfully reproduced Japan in that time. It was really cool. Yeah, it's shockingly good. 
Uh, like, you don't necessarily expect that often with a lot of TV stuff these days. They try to cheap out. Yeah, of course. But no, it, it really looks like they did it. Oh, I got a feather. Resting one's head on these is a treatment for illness. Wispy and white, often used in basic healing potions. Hey guys, I have a question. Who washes their curtains? Does anybody wash their curtains? <laughs> no. Okay. I think I have one curtain in my house. Um, oh, I got an ash. I got, I got ash. Um, well, my daughter has allergies. And oh, I, she. Then you gotta wash them. Well, I know, and I just washed everything on her bed. Oh my god! Come here, run in the fire! God, I'm burning run things to death. In the fire. I'm burning them to death. This is some upsetting. Animal parts. Might taste like pumpkin pie, but you'll never know. What is that? Okay. Huh. Okay. All right. So when I lift these up, it actually undoes stuff. So that's good. Okay, I do, but only because I have allergies. So you wash her, yeah, so I gotta wash her. I washed all her bedding. I got like mattress cover, dust mite covers for her pillow and her mattress. We got rid of almost all of her stuffed animals. Like she kept like 15 of them, which I know that sounds like a lot of stuffed animals, but it was about a, maybe a fourth or a fifth of the total number. So as you can imagine, she had a lot of stuffed animals. I mean, couldn't you with the stuffed animals just every so often toss a handful of them in the dryer? Yes, absolutely. You can do that. But um, she had so many. Like, I'm talking like, and it was just, it took Problematic a- Problematic amount. Well, she has a crib full of them. And then I got had this crib, right, that I wanted to give yeah. away. I had taken one of the side rails off of it and put it in storage. I tried to get a, give it away on Facebook and turns out one of the railings got water damage and I lost all the bolts. So now I think I just have to put the thing on the curb I really want to give it away. I mean, it would be, make a good dog bed at least. So I don't know. I'll, I guess I'll post it on buy that thing with like, this is it. Do you want it? Otherwise I'll just throw it away, which I hate throwing away something that's functional, but I ruined it. But it wasn't my fault. I really wanted to store it. I stored it for th five years. She never even used it. <laughs> you fucked up. I know. You could also, you could also get one of those things that like sucks the dust out of the air. Uh, I do have one of those. I need to replace her filter. I fucking hate those things. I feel like they don't actually work. The bull just won't leave me alone. It charges right at me anytime I don't go near it. Maybe it's your red shirt? I thought they were colorblind. I'm tall, handsome, and dumb. I have to say, he's really hot in the close-up, but in the far away, he is... There's No, there's nothing I like in there. Okay. How do I jump over here? So you're only down if you're real close to the guy. Wait, let me see. Look at this guy. Yeah, look. He's hot here, but the, the wide is a little less hot because his eyebrows are way too, like... Aggressive? Yeah, aggress aggressively round. Yeah, okay. Goodwill will not take it because it's a broken mattress. And then the, the... the They're just... I don't know. I think I'll... Maybe somebody will take it just for their dog. Hi, puppy. Hi. Well, uh, hey, guess what? The bull likes me. Maybe I can lead him out and, oh, this is what I want to do. I'll lead the bull out and murder this guy, right? <laughs> this rat's nest is invulnerable to my potions. It must be due to the papers the rat stole from my granny. Didn't hear about that. I wonder what's inside. All right, well, let's, I, that looks like a plot twist I'm gonna have to deal with later. I need some kind of weapon in order to murder people. I don't understand. Come here, Soap Sprite. Come here. Come here, little. Yeah. Oh, look, it's a grave. I bet this would grow easily with a bit of care. Oh, okay. Crush! If there's a box around, it's mine, and I will crush it. Okay, oh I... man, I just ate a salami stick and it was so good. Oh, I haven't eaten. I mean, I had a salad and a lemon meringue pie and it was not, you know, I wanted to balance it out. Wait, I haven't eaten followed up by, well, I did have a salad and then a lemon meringue pie. <laughs> you know. It sounds like you've eaten. I did, but it didn't feel like it. Okay, now I gotta go back home and make a potion for granny. 
Hey, what's up, Starcrier? Yeah, okay, at four o'clock. Ugh. I don't know. Oh, this is number one, so it feels like, oh, look! Oh, my card, open that up. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, baby. Look at this, I'm breaking in. Give me them apples. Give me them all. Give me them apples. Give me them apples. I want everything. Hey, did you see Ken, uh, the I'm Just Ken performance? No, what? Uh, at the Oscars? I did not watch it, no. I, I mean, I didn't watch it. I just, I, I mean, I can't watch it anymore because it doesn't, I used to watch it when I was younger. Yeah. But like, you can't watch it anywhere but on cable and I don't have Oh, cable. really? Oh, I did I not mean, know that. I mean, where else would you watch it? Yeah, I guess you're right. Okay. They don't like stream they it. They don't on YouTube, stream it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine the audience it would get if they streamed it. I wish I was going to C2E2 too. I love that con. Um, something ha happened. Oh, confetti bomb. Can't touch C2E2? this. C2E2 is in Chicago and it's a really cool con. Stop and celebrate. Red dye, blue dye, feather, mana. Okay, well, we can't make that. But I did use my card to open that bronze gate. And when we get a gold one, one I guess it's one key, five keys, three keys. Okay. Well one keys, five keys, three keys. Yeah. Oscars aren't for core cord cutters. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's snobby. Whatever, oh man. look! If I go down and up these, will it respawn every time? Look at me trying to break the game like Adam does. Okay, hang on. Yep, look at I that. Efficiently. Okay, this is awesome. I like this game because now I know how to exploit it. I mean, do you need that many Arctic poppies right now? In my know? life? Yes. <laughs> Once you figure out whether it makes sense to have that many, okay, maybe. Well, That's I just, I'm greedy. I'm a greedy guts. Mm. I don't think the, obviously the boxes. Oh, you've gathered all the ingredients. Perfect. Let me show you how to craft them. This is where you can craft potions by combining ingredients. All potions take three ingredients to craft. Some will require specific ingredients, while others may only require mana combinations. Each ingredient has a mana value. The feather you gathered, for example, contributes one air mana. Now let's craft that minor explosion potion and kill some people in this town. This potion is rare in that it uses three types of manas. Most potions are crafted with only two different kinds of mana. Combine mushroom with ash and a feather. Okay. Um, ash. Uh, mushroom. And then a feather, right? Okay, here we go. Craft. Yeah, baby! Wonderful, dear. Your first potion. Poison. Now go explode someone. You can review the recipe for the recipe book in the right of icon and you craft as many you have a greedy for. You can make it with other ingredients of the same elements too. Okay, make sure to look for the ingredient with different mana values in your explorations. Those rare higher mana ingredients can make potions that really pack a punch. Remember though, you can only carry 10 vials of a potion. Okay, wait, this is good. So let me do mush doom spores. And- an anarchist? Where's the Arctic mushroom? Okay. What does she want you to blow up? I don't know. Let's make it. How do I make it? <laughs> make this bomb and go blow some shit up. <laughs> Wait, I need to put three Thanks, in Grandma. here? We don't know. How do I make this? Fire potion. Okay. Oh, there's lots of potions to be made. Okay, let's just do... Um... I don't know. Let's do two Arctic craft. What does this make? Huh? Protective draught. But I thought she said most potions only take two. Maybe you got oh. two of one? Two of one. All right. I'm just putting in... So is there, does it always have to have a base? Yeah, it says she always has to have a base. What about just earth? Only earth. Minor rock bomb. Okay. What about only air? Three feathers. Let's let's see what it does. You always need three items. Okay. Minor wind bomb. Okay. I bet. Call me crazy. I think this is going to be a minor water bomb. Question is a minor wind bomb a fart? 
No, it's blue dye, but okay. What about three fire? Oh, I don't have enough ash! Damn it. Oh, God. Minor cone of lava? That's kind of nice. All right, well, I need more ash. What are you gonna do with a minor cone of lava? I'm gonna kill one of those kids. <laughs> I'm not. Would you like to equip one of these new potions? Yes. Give the blue dye to the farmer, said Thalon. Kick on the cauldron, it's done. Will you please pay a visit to the Callum at the farm? I feel I lost my stone of recall when I was looking in his dry well. Make sure to take some minor explosion potions with you. Callum has a nasty rat problem there. Aggressive things even stole my papers from my bag. Can you hear you can change your equipped Callum. potions? Callum and his rat problem. I got minor explosion, minor rock bomb, minor rock bomb. I probably need to make some more explosions. I see you've collected a good amount of potion ingredients. Let's store them. I'll store your ingredients, whatever you return home. Oh, great. So wait, I need a uh, fire. Wait, what is it? Recipe book. Minor explosion potion is fire, air, and earth. We don't have any more fire, so we. Well, we'll just figure it out. If I, <laughs> yeah. One bronze card. You can unlock the magical door to the back of our home, and don't fear they won't disappear. We did it already, Grammy. Ash is easy to come by. Yeah, we're good. This is a really cute game, you guys. I could see myself playing a lot of this. Although my heart is deep rock galactic right now. Of course, always. Oh, come here. How do I get over here? Is this like- Does this work on uh, Steam Deck? Uh, I don't know, I don't have one. I do not have a Steam Deck. Probably for a good reason because you would obsessively be playing deep rock on the toilet. Yeah, for sure. No, I have to confine my video gaming. You should get your kid a Steam Deck, though. Uh, no, she got a Nintendo Lite. We just haven't gotten into it. It's just been really hard to... Okay. Oh, the, could, that lo the, could that rat have stolen Granny's Stone of Recall? Select the potion you wish to use by pressing a number or clicking the potion bar and then right-click. You may press left-kick to... Okay. Oh, dead! Dead! Murdered! Yes, I feel good about myself now. And I got my granny's stone of recall to go back home. So wait, how did you kill that? I threw a potion at it. I guess that's the only thing I can do here. But we got a bunch of ash. This is awesome. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... By burning that rat alive? <laughs> yeah, I burned it alive. Look at that. The minor yeah. explosion did it. This is great. So basically, I used the potions as weapons. All right, let's go talk to this guy. I'm gonna talk to this guy, because I, I know, I don't know if I'm underage or not, but I just wanna play, play the field a little bit, okay? This rat's nest is invulnerable to my potions. It must be due to the papers. Okay, so we can't do anything here. Can I give this guy? Can I kill this bull? Should I try it? That bull looks grossly muscly. I know. All right, I'm gonna save Pretty it. Quick question. Why am I seeing TikToks about you, like, obsessing over hot horses. I, I accidentally followed a hot horse TikTok account, and it's just like lovingly emphasizing their flanks a little bit too uncomfortably, and yet I can't look away. They're so shiny. It's kind of like that character. Well, you realize you keep calling them hot horses, right? They are hot. They're hot horses. Okay. Um... Really changes the whole perspective. Of the horse Whoa! Game. That's pretty potent dye. I am very blue. I hoped it would help you with your bull problem. Oh my god! I just like look at. <laughs> I mean, it will, won't it? I love it. That's amazing. That's mighty kind of you, Luna. But dealing with ordinary animals is just part of my job. Please don't explode blue all over me again. Not that I'm ungrateful. Here's a little gift. I got an apple. Can I get more apples, buddy? Okay, well that was really funny. I'm sorry, that was really funny. 
I just assaulted him. Did you see it? It's like he's head to toe. Now he's recovered, unfortunately. All right. Well, now I just need to use my granny stone. Oh, look, we got a heart stone. Snow, snorrow, snow. You may have the proper permits, but I'll monitor your use of this vile sorcery. Oh, oh yes, oh, Luna, welcome home, my dear. What, how did she get here? What trickery is this, witch? Oh, splendid, you found my stone of recall. Kill this guy. Is she of age to be using such devilry? I have you now. The stone will turn you to my home from wherever you might travel. Are you even listening to me? I have authority here, and I don't like commutes either. Give me that stone. My deepest apologies for neglecting your tantrum, my prince. Luna has seen her twelfth cycle of the seasons. So she is of age to use these trinkets and study potion brewing herself. Oh, she's 12. Listen, I thought people were hot at 12. I definitely didn't do anything about it, but okay. Shall I brew a mood and answer for you? You seem quite troubled. No, I... Like, does this guy's outfit, has Ryan ever showed you that like weird patch? Yes, that he was involved yes, in? it's the best thing ever. <laughs> Hang on, when he comes up, I'm gonna take a screenshot and send it to him. So weird. Uh, he's basically in this amazing outfit that makes him look like a page from like the the court of Louis Vuitt uh, <laughs> not Louis Vuitton but Louis the Sixteenth. So yeah. The prince has adopted an interesting approach for his stay in Old Haven. Who is he? He's Prince Charming, the youngest prince of the royal family. No matter how how was recovering the stone of recall. I had to fight a rat down in the well to get it. I murdered. Good job, my dear. While we work to save lives, conflict is sometimes unavoidable or necessary. Is it? Do you think toad eyes grow on trees? I fear not. I've murdered so many toads in my life. But you'll find much from benefiting and only killing what you need to, as force is often met with force. Riku Kitty, this is the cutest game. I really think it has a great vibe. The art is great. The music is wonderful. And I want to kick that other little girl's butt. Many things can be gained with other methods of approach. Here, let me enter this recipe for a minor potion of healing in your recipe book to heal you in any future encounters. Okay. Oh, look. Okay. So we have one air, one water, one earth. Ryan is playing Persona for Golden. Did he just boot it up? Yep. Okay. I was obsessed with that game. Okay, so let's give some minor potions of healing to everybody. Okay, so we need a water, an earth, and, oh, I don't want to waste that, um, earth, and a wind. There we go. <laughs> Plot twist, Granny was burned at the stake by Prince Charming and Luna goes on a rampage. I will, I'll explode them. Nobody hurts my grandma. I, I just like the idea that we could just combine things. I think it's fun. All right. Oh, wait, we could do multiples. Okay. Nice. Emily sucks. Yeah, Riku Kitty. Okay, so I guess we have the creator of the game in chat, you guys. Riku Kitty is here. Thank you all so much for your kind words. Yes, it's adorable. And the fact that you got, you released your game in the same week that EA released so many other games really sucks. I really hope you get reviewed by a lot of people and people discover your game because I know that you put a lot of work into this for many years. Also like a, just to reiterate that, like if you play a game that you enjoy by a developer for the love of God, please yep. go to their steam page and leave a review and tell them that you enjoy it. Yes. It is insanely important to getting more visibility on products especially ones you enjoy, and it will help cater the algorithm to show you more stuff like it. Thanks, David. Oh, that's sweet. Yes, I will tell you, I didn't know this, but I did, I, you were not here, Adam, but um, the whole thing about my film is that we don't have like huge, huge stars in it. So in order to get distribution so that people could ever watch it outside of a film festival situation, we need a thousand reviews on IMDb. And that's hard. Oh, wow. I know it's hard because we're in film festivals and there's like maybe 200 seats every time. So we yeah. have to do like four or five festivals over the summer and hope that people go home and give a good review. Yeah. Um, but you know. Uh-oh. 
What? Okay. Binding a foe is effective for escaping danger. I learned that lesson well on my third voyage. Here's this guy. Being around so much magic and filth is utterly disgusting. Give me more mulberry wine. Dude, why do you have a Wonder Woman thing on your head? Okay. <laughs> It is right. Yes, film festival. It is right, yeah. It is film festivals. Basically, you can see it Wednesday night if you are in the San Jose area. And then we're waiting. There's a couple of film festivals it's been accepted to. So just hoping people, you know, over the year, hopefully, get, get some um, momentum. It's really funny. I, I did not know what to expect. It's so violent. And the F-bomb is, is it, very... What is it called again? Huh? It's called Tim Travers called? and the Time Tra uh, Tyvo Paradox. Oh, yeah, yeah. I remember you talking about this. Oh, hello, it's you. What do you want? I've come to deliver a potion for the Huntsman. So you're playing the errant girl now? Did Granny figure out you have no talent? I brewed this minor potion of healing myself. And this one of explosives, too. <laughs> Jesus, what the hell happened? I don't know. This girl is such a bee. Just give it to me. I expect proper compensation if it makes my father jealous, even more ill. I didn't cool, I didn't know that distributors cared about IMDb either, Starcraft Fix. This is all new because I've never done film festival stuff. I get invited to so many film festivals now for some stupid reason because I was tagged as producer for uh, Animal Talking. Oh, really? Like, I, I need you to understand. I don't do this this is not my job i mean i will say that it was fun i it was a really nice atmosphere to be in because there were all these filmmakers and they had filmmaker mix up mixers and just meaning the people who made oh, nice. made all these movies outside the the system and they were just hoping to mm -hmm. maybe get some attention on them and share their story and made them for no money and i just yeah it was a really nice scrappy like guild feel and because filmmakers you know they're not making web series or anything like so if you want like low budget film you got to go to film festivals now yeah. The and then Mickey Mouse showed up and killed all the filmmakers. Yeah. And made sure their films would never be seen. The obnoxious hothead is har harassing other people as you let me add water bomb to your recipe book. Ooh, three waters, minor water bomb. You shouldn't feel limited by your recipes though. Mix combinations of ingredients with two types of animal create potions. Feel free to experiment. Your next task is quite beyond our brewing ability, however. For one, there's another item every witch should carry. I forgot I was old. You'll need to visit my elder sister in the deep dark forest. She won't be difficult to find. Just look for a hut perched a parrot atop a pair of chicken legs. <laughs> All right. <laughs> That's the one. Take this cut handkerchief. I wrapped up some ham and a slice of bread for you. A little snack to keep your feet light on the journey. Right. What is that called? The hut, hut on on top of chicken legs? It's like... Uh, Baba Yaga. Baba Yaga. A couple of these. Oh, no. All right, maybe... So this is all very much, like, coded towards, like, myths and... Yeah. Uh, uh, what is this? Fairy tales and such, it seems. What is... I'm making... I'm putting three waters together. Okay, I had to do apples. But I got some red dye. What was that other one? What was the other one that needed I needed to be in the basement? Remember that? No, I don't. I needed red dye and blue dye. I need a potion. I'm gonna go down here and see. Give me an Arctic shark. Okay, red dye and red dye and blue dye are specific ingredient recipes. All blueberries are all. Okay, so if I used. Oh, okay, so I just got this recipe from here. Okay, so. Okay, got you. I just got the recipe book. Minor explosion cone, minor cone of lava. How do I get past the, how do I get the other kinds of spells? Here? Oh, there we go. Minor water bomb, minor rock bomb, minor wind bomb, protective draught. Oh, here we go. Elementless potions. Blue dye, red dye, confetti bomb. That's the confetti bomb. Okay, so blue dye, red dye, and a feather. Oh, I gotta go do that right now. And make some confetti bombs? Yeah. I'm gonna make a confetti bomb. Who are you gonna throw it at? I'm gonna throw it at my, uh, that girl, Emily. 
Wow, to celebrate her awesomeness. Her awfulness, yeah. Okay, so awesomeness. now, where is the die though? I guess we can't make the confetti bomb because it doesn't show up here. Oh, here we go. Uh, on the far side. Yeah, here we go, and then a feather. There we go! Confetti bomb! Yes! Oh, I can't wait to use it. I'm gonna use it on that girl who actually has a crush on me. I mean, not a crush, because we're 12. You can have a crush at 12. Loud, what is it? Okay, well, how? I had a crush on a guy when I was five. I distinctly remember it. Wow. I don't even remember being that young. <laughs> you like that? Oh, she didn't even care, this dumb girl. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what was that for? I'll have you know these silks are extremely costly. Well, who do you think you are? I got an achievement. Waterworks. Oh. <laughs> but what? Oh, but this guy what? loves it. What? This guy loves it. Innkeeper, Corey gave me silver ore. Ooh. Oh. Which is two different. Corey. Yeah, and that's two He's different. Got a fetish, doesn't yeah. He? I had a crush in second grade. No, I was five years old and I distinctly remember imagining walking down the aisle, marrying my friend's uncle who was in his early twenties and who brought me a Sanrio Hello Kitty Amazing. Um, from Thailand. Oh. He was Thai yeah. and he was so gotcha. sweet. Hello Kitty. And he brought me a Hello Kitty stuffy, and I was like, well, we're getting married. He also got me a, a painting of a um, ballerina. Supermarket simulator. Okay, thank you, Garibane. I saw that. I'm just like so... I mean, I'm obviously between big games. I was going to do God of War, but I'm just too lazy to get the PS5 hooked up because I put I'm it away. I'm going to do God of War, she's been saying for the last two years. It's been one and a half years. I played half of it, and then now... Your what? dog chewed up your HDMI and your homework. It's true. Well, <laughs> it, listen, if, if if you tell me how to hook it up, I'll play. Oh, look, look, I want that thing. Wait, how do I jump? What are you talking about? <sighs> I'm always available. You know this. You just... Just now, you were like, Adam, get a chat. Because <laughs> I was here I mean, already I, anyway. I totally knew that you had nothing else going on. <laughs> it's just, it's an impossibility that you would ever be pre previously occupied. This saves me from actually doing work. And then I'll be tired from doing this and maybe I'll consider having a nap. <laughs> oh. Your work ethic is strong. I will tell you that. There was a time I was strong. That's how I got where I am now. Yeah, no, that's me. I'm enjoying the fruits of my labor. I want to enjoy the fruits of my labor for the rest of my life. Oh, okay. So now I need to explode these. Okay. Ow! My God, I just blew myself up. Grandma Treasure, this is a very cute game. The dev is in chat, but I'm not saying that because of that. I'm saying it because I believe that you should play this game if you like farming and stuff. If you like potion making or farming, look at that, I'm deep in the woods, y'all. Adam is complaining. I mean, Steve, you know him. Does he ever not complain? What? There are times. Ooh. Listen, I'm just very tired from fighting the How long have you played that game? Threats. Two hours? Wait, which game? The game that you've been playing. Uh, Helldivers? Mm -hmm. Did you say two hours? Have you been playing two- did you play Helldivers for two hours today, or what? I mean, I didn't play any today, but I heard there's a new major order today, so... Oh no, well you gotta get on there. Yeah. It's uh, completely Will and Gary were telling me that it's like... Really, you gotta, like, set up these giant towers that will... <laughs> on the bug planets that will... Oh no! Gas and gas the bug planets. Yeah, okay, okay. We're the good guys. Good guy, yeah, of course. Of course you are. Yeah, of course you are. <gasps> Ooh, water crystals! 20% cooler than ice. It counts for two water mana. Oh, boy. Ooh, Zach went for... 85 hours of that. 
I mean, oh, I got the silver. Wait, did that silver? I think it opened a gate um, in the, doesn't that open a gate, y'all, in uh, the farm? That was the silver? Okay. This ominous music, someone's gonna die. Oh God, it's... I've played 15 hours of Deep Rock. 15 hours isn't that much, is it? I mean, it's more than you already. I mean, can you tell how much I've played? Yes. I mean, that's not surprising, though. I actually do have things to do with my life, and you don't. Yeah, but you still played 12 hours, so calm down. <laughs> 12 hours? I did play time. Yeah, I've been playing offline, I will admit. When I have an hour free, I'm like, you know, I'm tired. I'm a little bit stressed out. I need to decompress. I don't go to the spa. I go to the Deep Rock. I go to the yeah. Deep Rock Spa. Yeah, it makes sense. You know what's another game uh, that would be great for relaxation for you? Uh-huh. Um, uh, it's by a developer I know, and it's called Summer House. Uh huh. And all it is is you just there's just a couple buttons you can click, and you put down pieces of a house, and you just build a house in a nice looking pixelated area. Oh, that's nice. Build a house. Sounds up my alley. Yeah. As you put certain objects together, like you know, uh, maybe a cat appears, and now you can place the cat in different places. And oh, that sounds uh, really fun. Yeah, I, I think you would like it. It's all one word. Summer House. Is it just came out? Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. Uh, I gotta kill these guys. What's that red thing? Uh, I think I killed it, but I don't have enough potions. Ah! Gotta kill He's this still guy! Alive. I know, I don't I want this mushroom. How, why can't I have a sword? I've got to, oh, I really should be, okay. So like, actually I need to plan this game out. Ow! What other potions do you have? Why are you running to where more bad guys are? I needed to open that up. Oh, I just picked up, did I pick up a, I picked, I'm sorry, but I picked up a fire? Yeah, you got ash. Oh. Oh, okay, that was ash. Look at this kitty! Oh, <gasps> kitty! Kill it. No, it's so cute! It looks like the lady I just made the other the, earlier. Its oh. ribs are almost visible. Yes. I gave it my ham. Thank you, miss. Hunger truly is the best spice. That hit the spot perfectly. You can talk? It is rather surprising. I admit some say it's most, um, my most unfortunate skill. My name, oh, he's a Pokemon. My, <laughs> my name is Helios and what brings you to this with the forest, young man, young one. I was sent to ask a favor from the woman who lives here. You're either very bold or awfully foolish, but as one good turn to serve the other, I shall accompany you. Turn around and bow low, bother some hut. The old crone has a visitor. Wow, looks as if this could shatter easily. Man, I don't have any more shatter stuff. Oh, I did get ash. When can I jump over these things? I'll jump over here. Oh, hey, you got raided by Soul Correction. <gasps> Thank you for the raid! Party. But they did say, wish I had more people to come with me, but today was my 10th stream ever. Yay, congratulations! I am very happy for you, and I really appreciate you raiding me. That was so sweet. We are about to actually finish up as well. Um, oh, I can make, we can refill the satchel. I don't know how to do that. Wait, refill this satchel? Why would I want to refill the satchel? Oh, maybe uh, I refilled my satchel? No, okay, I don't know, no idea. Ding -a -ding -a -ding. Well, okay, we're gonna go in here and then I have to go. I really do actually have stuff to do or I would just sit here and play for another three hours. <laughs> Okay. The old gate squeaks checked. and grows. Huh? <laughs> double check uh, to see if that bot streamer was still playing. <laughs> That's what they're doing now. What is she doing? <laughs> She's playing Fortnite on her butt. <laughs> on her butt? Oh, she's yeah. brilliant. <laughs> Firebomb? It's so good. I don't know what I should do here. Silver ore? I need to oil something. How, what, how do I make an oil? 
Mm. Um, did anyone tell you? Soma, thank you. You can craft in the cauldron. Thank you. Thanks, Soul Correction. Um, minor explosive, you think? Minor cone of lava. Okay, that didn't work. What about one fire and two mushrooms? We got lots of these. Minor cone of spikes. That's cool. What about? Hey, can you can you look and see outside of the cauldron? Uh, like leave the cauldron for a minute. Okay. And oh, I forgot I was delayed. So fart night. Um. Is there anything around here that'll tell you about how to do that? How to make an oil? Maybe the firebomb? Well, maybe the firebomb will do it. I don't know. Let's see if we can burn it. Let's <laughs> see if we can burn it. That's your answer to everything! I know. Nope! See that rock there? Nope! Oh, let's... Well, we can uh, raid Neil. Go down to that rock. We could shatter this, yes. Let's see if we can shatter it with ice. What is on top nope. of the rock, though? Nope, gotta do a rock shatter here. Would well, that's earth, I think? Minor rock bomb, that's what I need, okay. I just wasted a bunch of potions, but that's okay. Yes! I got some oil canister, and then I think that's opened it. Okay. Oh, I gotta, I gotta ring the bell. Oh, I didn't even shoot that thing at the. Okay. I... Oh, look at that, you guys. Whoa! Oh, it's another nipple. It's another nipple vest. Oh dear, are you okay? What's wrong? I just <laughs> crazy that a big finale. Duck. I'm gonna comfort this guy, yeah. There, there, it can't be so bad. Here, take my handkerchief. Thank you ever so much, sweet thing. It's rare for a kind soul to venture into my domain. Who are oh, you? Oh, God. Wow, I just created this character, too. Who are you? Who Are you my grandmother's sister? I'm called many things, but you may call me Baba Yaga, sister to all and to none. Pleased to meet you, Baba Yaga. My name is Luna. I was told you could help me craft an item of great power. I know who you are and what you seek, but my aid is never freely given. I shall provide you my broom, but I will need the material to craft another. Thus, I have a task for you. A broom for cleaning? No, no, you silly girl, for flying. After I grant this bone to thee, you must gather three items three. First a breath of willow bring, deep as shadow, bright as spring. Golden straw must next be won, the kind by fickle goblin spur. Th spun, then find dust from ferret's wings, from pixie's magic mushroom rings. Once these talismans you have gathered, return to me and hear my answer. Or if these forces you can tame, which is bounty you shall claim. Ha! <laughs> a flying broom will be very helpful. I'll gather these materials for you to replace it. Thank you. Oh, I can fly! Be careful! Oh, we can fly over. Watch this! <gasps> yes! Yes! I you waited for. Oh, look, a turkey. All right, uh, guys, I, I do have to go. Turkeys are jerks. That turkey, turkeys are awful, awful. Whee! I do like seeing videos of people being chased by turkeys. So it's very funny. Yeah, it's pretty funny. Oh, look at this. I feel like it, could it hurt you, a turkey? Oh yeah, they could, they could pick an eye out. Whoa, 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 we have a silk. Yeah, but you're not gonna put your eyes where they can access them. Actually, this game is really fun. I haven't seen a game like this where you have to, like, literally craft everything to get through all the puzzles and stuff. I think that's really clever. Mm -hmm. I mean, like, I need to, like, somehow really stock up on, um... I need to stock up on a bunch of, of different potions. Ooh, I'm in the spider's den. I'm gonna die, but I'm about to log off, so it doesn't matter. Ooh, spider webs. What's in here, huh? Everybody just going in here, just checking it out. Whoa! All right, I'm going in here. I have no ammunition. I'm gonna die. Oh, look, I got a crystal. 
And I got, oh, I think I can probably gather spider. Can I gather, gather this? Okay, I'm sorry, but this broom is very fun. Oh, Yatevio! A tree with droopy tendrils and a big fleshy leaves. It wraps unaware travels in its leaves and sucks their blood. Mm. Oh no. Sorry, buddy. I I wish I could kill you, but not gonna happen. Alright. Yeah, thank you, Riku Kitty. I definitely would love to play this again if I have time. It's very sweet. It, it's like, oh no. I'm cornered and I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Ah! Go around him. Oh, you're, oh, there you go. oh god. This is clearly an advanced level that I should not be at, but it's kind of fun, like, oh, I should have stocked up on X amount of potions. And or you keep going forward. I can't do anything. All I have is a healing potion. Alright, I'm gonna save it. Oh, you probably have to burn those. Yeah, I gotta burn those, yeah. All right, we're gonna um, raid Neil. Neil New Newbone. How do you spell his name? New. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Guys. Oh boy. Uh... Oh my God. How do you spell Neil's last name? Uh, Are you Googling Newbon. it now? Newbon. It's. It is Newbon. Guys. Yeah, you said New Bone. Okay, listen. That was wrong. <laughs> it was the incorrect thing. Guys, thank you so much. I'm going to try. Oh, so Friday I'm working uh, and Saturday. I might try to stream Sunday night, actually, or Sunday afternoon, but probably not because I'll be gone two days with my daughter. Um, I'm going to try to stream maybe Thursday evening or, but I'm, Thursday is a loose time when I want to stream again. Okay. But I will let you know. Check my Discord. Say hi to Neil for me. He is one of the nicest people I've ever met. And that's it. Okay. Bye.